Welcome back. We're inside the mines. And the music here is actually fucking incredible. I really, really like the music in here. It may be one of my favorites so far. I mean, Dirtmouth music is top tier, but this is also really nice. Man, all the music has been great. Don't have a map. You know what? I've changed my mind. I'm gonna go back to the City of Tears. I, th I feel like I'm spreading myself a little too thin right now. Everywhere. Also, it's been a... Uh, it's been a lunch since I played last, so I, of course I already forgot how to play the game. <laughs> Get up there. Uh, I believe I came from the left here. So let me try and go that way. Ah! Uh, oh, shit, that's the other way. Here we go. Somewhere this way. Is the exit. So this guy I just hit like that. Not too much of a problem. Uh, I guess I can just wall jump up here. No problem there either. Here we are. That is actually a curious shell right here. Behind me. Almost looks like... Hmm. An outfit or something for a big bug. God, I hate the sounds of those walking around. Ugh. Okay, forgotten crossroads. Let me open my map. And do some house cleaning here. This I will now remove. Perfect. We know that leads to Crystal Peak. So what I want to do, I go to the tram, and I basically go down here. There's still a bunch of stuff I haven't done in the City of Tears. So many areas to explore. So, let me do that. Especially because Quirrell mentioned there was a Nail Master down there. So that sounds very useful. I think I went a little too far here. There. So I want to check that out also. Let's heal up. <sighs> hey, buddy. Take me to the city storerooms, I guess. By the way, I thought of something in the in the break I had. Sly mentioned after I bought out his store, after I emptied his entire inventory, he told me that he may have some trinkets left in an old storage room. And... I didn't, it didn't process for me at the time, but it said, he says trinkets, right? Cornifer is looking for trinkets for Zelda. So maybe I can get a trinket from Sly somehow and give it to Cornifer. I'm, I'm really hoping I can do that. I keep thinking about it, actually. I don't think there is a quest system in this game because there hasn't been any so far. And we've, we're quite far in the game, I think. Uh... Let's go this way. So where so where haven't I been? I've actually done a lot. I cleared Soul Sanctum, man. There's still a door in there that I can't unlock. Because I need a special key. The simple key is not enough. I need advanced key. <laughs> uh, I can go all the way down to the right. I kind of want to explore that statue looking thing in the very bottom right there. I can also go to the left first. Hold on. Let me see the map here. If I go, so if I go this way, perhaps I will appear in the fungal waste. Maybe that makes sense to connect those two. Yeah, let me do that. Let me go all the way down. Oh, I knew I was going to hit something. Uh-oh. I don't remember if I've actually been down here. Oh, wait, I have to go down and to the right first. I was completely uh, not aware of my current whereabouts there. Da! Ah! <laughs> These bastards. At least they make the screeching sound so you know they're coming. Da! Ah! Sir! Let me heal. Okay, you're not gonna... Alright, you wanna die? That's fine. 
Uh, heal up. Oh, I love the rain. It's so fitting because it's raining today as well, you know? It's the perfect ambiance for this area. Ah! Fuck. Let's just heal up again. So I go down. I just have to go down. Oh, god damn it. Forgot that was an elevator. Okay, and then we do that. Have we been here? Yeah, this is the thing. Yeah, quarantine. I got it. Ah, oh, fuck. Now I have to go back up like this. Hit that. Hmm, I wonder if there's a secret up there now. I'm gonna check it out later. I get distracted way too easily here. You know, I should rest on that bench. Just in case I fuck things up. Really nice piano here, man. Ah, you know what? Fuck you. Mm, keep going down. Have I actually been here? If I'm not mistaken, that looks like a nail symbol there. So maybe that's a nail master. Let me just quickly check here first. Um, I don't recall if I've been exactly here. Maybe I have. Maybe I went down and I went to the right without thinking too much about it. Yeah, I remember this. I, d I destroyed that. There was money inside. Uh, okay, go down. Now, quick experiment. Can I swim? Oh, I can! That's fucking good to know. I was like 99% sure that wasn't gonna work. <laughs> I'm actually surprised I can swim. Why can I swim? Why don't I just die when I fall down there? That has to mean there's some kind of mechanic utilizing this. Can I spell while I do this? I can't even attack while I'm in this state. Okay, let me go to what I appear what I assume is the nail master. I see you. Venge fly. Venge die, more like. <laughs> what was that just now? I've had that happen a couple times. Is it like a parry mechanic that I'm not understanding? Maybe if he attacks at the same time that I attack, none of us take damage? Can I also jump here? So I have to... There has to be like a little hit secret there somewhere. Maybe there's like a little pipe I can get through in one of these places. Also, look at the background. The fungal waste is there. Or it looks to be the fungal waste at least. What is this? Look at the nails in the ground. And the waterfall in the back. What is that thing in the background there? Oh, they're just giant uh, shells. Andre? Dude, I'm getting uh, <laughs> Andre vibes here from Dark Souls with the clinging that I'm hearing. Oh my god, I'm all the way to the left here. Okay. <laughs> now that's cozy. Hmm, Vendazu. Have you brought me another nail to be honed? Leave it on the ground and return later if you're still breathing. Ah, Rango huh? Stenja. Oh, I thought you were someone else. Okay, it's just Nailsmith. After a Nailsmith, are you? Well, you've found one. I'm not much for talk. But if it's a nail that needs repair, then you've come to the right bug. Your own nail is in quite a sorry state. It's obviously not one of mine. Still, anything can be refined with enough effort and skill. Even that broken blade. 
If you'd like, I can reforge your nail. It'll make the blade far more deadly. Shit. Yeah, man. I wonder how it's going to reinforce it. As you wish. I'll get to work then. <laughs> nice. Garadel Akari. There we go. The reforging is complete. I've honed your nail's edge. You'll find it much stronger than it used to be. Head out there and test its strength against your foes. Really? Hmm. Hmm. You're still here. Is there something else you want? If you bring me a piece of pale ore, I can forge it into your nail and make it stronger still. Pale ore. See you later, Nailsmith. Look at all the nails around him. Look at the little chimney. That's fantastic. Uh... Sharpened nail. A traditional weapon of Hallow Nest, restored to lethal form. I don't remember what it said before. Blunt nail or something? Oh, that was lucky. Well, what just what was that? Something fell from the roof. Oh, it actually keeps falling. It's just water, I think. Also curious, it's not raining here. Ah, I guess it is a little bit. But is this... Is this still the City of Tears, I wonder? Hold on, I... Let me see if I feel a difference here. I didn't pay attention. Oh my god. Ah, Jesus, let me jump on you! I am dying here. I don't... Remember how many hits they took before. If it's any different. Okay, that's a one-shot! Holy fuck! Okay, that's definitely better. Wow! Oh, shit, man. Hell yeah. Um, let me... You know what? Let me go to the bench real quick. I want to fill out the map. Let me jump on you. Let's see how many hits. Four hits. I, I, I'm playing sloppy right now. Where's the bench? Right above me. I want to see what the area looks like in the nailsmith area there. When I have a map. Map updated. Let's see it. Okay, that looks pretty much closed. Looks like the Nailsmith area. Okay, so I guess what I will do now is I'll go down again to the right and then see if I can explore this area. It seems to be there's something here, right? And then I'll go this way afterwards. That seems reasonable. Let's do it. Okay, let me try and fight this guy for real. Like, like, like. There we go. Can't be sloppy. It's gonna put this nail into embarrassment if I don't use it properly, right? I can't speak English nice. <laughs> Get away. Okay, I'm definitely feeling a difference here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Maybe it took five or six hits before. Don't quite recall exactly how much. I don't remember if I've been exactly here. I do remember a bunch of platforms like this. But if it's exactly this platforming area or not, I'm not sure. Let me just keep going up. Come on, what you gonna do? Okay, you're gonna hit me. That makes sense, I guess. Come on. Nope. Too slow. Bitch. So I really want to dash to the left right now and see what's over there. Let me go to the right. Oh, you, you jumped up into me, you damn bastard. Smart. Nice. I have been this way. So maybe I cannot go further up here. Look at the background, by the way. Look at these huge towers with all the window-looking things. It is massive, this area. A big fucking cavern. 
Did I just jump on an environment there? Is that actually possible? Hold on. What did I jump on? Was it this one that I broke? So what does that sign mean? Is it pointing to... A district in the City of Tears, maybe? Oh! They die in the water, but I don't. Huh. That's interesting, I think. Look at this shoddy patchwork on the bridge behind me there. I really like the look of this place with the rain coming down. And then you have these pipes with water funneling out of it. It looks great. Fantastic use of uh, parallax here. Really gives you a sense of depth. What does that sign mean? Market district or something? <laughs> something up there. And mechanism with a simple keyhole. Use a simple key? Yes. Okay. I can go to the right. Let's see what's down here. Royal Waterways. Okay, that, that's a new area. Hold on. My god, I'm being overwhelmed by all the new areas here. I have so many places to go. Ah! I love it. But I also hate it because I can't decide. Let me put a... What is new area symbol? New area symbol... I'm not sure. Fuck it, let me put this one. No, let me put... Red. I think red is a good new area symbol because it's a, b before this it was a lantern symbol for me. Which in other words was a new area anyway. So it makes sense. Um, let me go up first. I want to see what that sign is. What oh, money, money, money. Uh, that's a bummer. That's closed. But oh, wait! That's right... That's right above me. Hold on. I have an idea. What if I can get... Up there? Uh, hold on. Man, it's so cool that I can one-shot those now. That is actually a great feeling. Holy fuck. Let me go up. And go across. this and I go in here and this is where I oh god this is the big guy right you do that oh man he's so much easier with the upgrade the nail here I never went down here aha <laughs> perfect I'm a genius so I can go right now oh a shop Warrison Gian Relic Seeker Lem. Let me write that. Relic Seeker Lem. Huh. Aye aye. Come searching for rare items, have you? Well, hands off. This collection is mine, and I won't be selling to grubby little wanderers. Still, I imagine you come across many interesting items in your travels. Maybe you'd care to part with some. I'll offer a fair trade for each. Velmi Artred. <gasps> oh, that's what they're for. Oh, Wanderer's Journal. These journals give us an interesting glimpse into the minds and hearts of those who lived before us. They're a common find, so I can't offer you too much for them. The Hallowness Seal. These ornate seals were the official symbols of the king and his knights, and were treasured by those who carried them. The king and his knights are long gone. 
but the seals still hold value as curiosities. I'll pay a modest price for them. So, does this confirm that the king is in fact gone? I was wondering this before, maybe the king was still alive somewhere inside the city, you know? But maybe he's actually just dead. Okay. And then the king's idol. An icon of Hellenist's king who was revered as both a god and a ruler. Made out of a mysterious white material, these are rare and very valuable. If you'll sell it to me, I'll pay a good price. I wonder if there's any other use for these other than selling them. Dude, there's like a million wanderers journals in the soul sanctum. You should go over there and collect them all, man. I... I guess I'll sell them all. A wanderer's journal, eh? Though there are common finds about the kingdom, I much enjoy the deciphering of their text. Read, to, read together, they paint a morbid tale. It seems fate was unkind to most who travel within Hellenest's ruin. Oh, hold on a second. Hmm, let me think. Maybe these Wanderer's journals were not actually a part of Hellenist until after it became desolate. Maybe it's all the people that went exploring the ruins of Hellenist, right? But then again, why would there be so many of them inside the Soul Sanctum? That, that clashes with that theory. Unless... These symbols do not always mean they're wanderers journals. Maybe they are just like stone tablets upon which people were writing back in the time. And in the soul sanctum, there were majors, there were scholars, right? All these clever bugs. They had to take notes somewhere, right? So maybe they just took notes on all of these stone tablets. But the travelers in the future who went on to explore the ruins of Hellenest, they used them as journals. I'm not sure. Can I really not sell more than one at a time? Really? I feel like that's such a basic thing. Another wanderer's journal. I might not offer a lot for each, but they're plentiful about the caverns, and I doubt you'll find another willing to make trade for Geo. Velmi Artrit. Velmi Artrit. Boris son? A Wanderer's Journal? Yes, yes. I'll add it to the pile with the others. I don't know when I'll get to decipher this one. It's long hard work translating the many languages of the bugs that explore these caverns. So that's why I couldn't read them. They need to be deciphered. Velmi Artrit. A wondrous journal? You've a knack for finding these. Corpses must be frequent on your journey. No doubt your nails created many more. Dude, you're so right. It's created a bunch, dude! Woo! A Hellenist seal, eh? Very interesting, this. Do you know of the kingdom's five great knights? They're revered figures of Hallownest, often mentioned in the annals of the kingdom, but only as a group. Do tell me more. Both their names and appearance seem to have been expunged from history. I wonder why did they do something terrible? So long has passed since their time. It'd be a grand achievement to discover their identities. I believe the false knight or whoever inhabited the false knight armor back in the time was one of the five knights. It had to have been. Why else would there be a giant statue of it at the gates to the capital? Where you needed to insert the city crest to open the gate. Okay, I think I understand why they didn't let me sell everything at once. You gonna get some lore every time and I actually love that. Son? Another Hellenist seal, pass it over. Ah, I enjoy collecting their like, but there's little information to be gleaned of each. 
Mind you, they do keep a nice shine about them, and there's nothing wrong with appreciating something purely on aesthetic merits. Velmi Artrit. I agree. Velmi Artrit. Give it here. Do you have anything else for me? If not, get your damp little self out of my home. <laughs> Whoa, buddy! Velmi Artrit. Really? Come on, man. Oh, pal. Another hell on a seal? Others have told me there's a statue out by the city's entrance depicting a large knightly figure. Could be one of the kingdom's great five. Heck yeah, buddy! I predicted that. I'm way ahead of you, uh, Lem. I'd have looked it over myself, but the gate's long been shut tight, and it's too much hassle. Taking the long way round with all those blasted husks about. Velmi Artrit. Oh my god, I'm gonna get lore from all of this. This is amazing. King's Idol. Kachail. A Lisa. King's Idol, eh? Halaness King was an elusive figure, deified by the citizens. With the king rarely seen, worship was offered through these idols. There's an expert craft to them. Few alive could match this skill. Hmm. Looks like you don't have any relics on you. If you manage to find any in good condition, bring them to me. And I'll give you a fair amount of geo for them. Dude, I have 4,000 geo. Are you kidding me? Holy fuck. I gotta use it. Man. Yo, Lem. Velmi Artrit. No touching the antiques. My stock is not for sale. Still, if you've managed to come upon any interesting trinkets during your travels, I may be willing to trade. Step over to the counter here and I'll see what, we've, what, you, what you've got. Velmi Artrit. There's a forgotten history hidden in this kingdom's antiques. Though few seem willing to look. Others, have, others come just to claw away at the cracks and ruins. Pah. Scavengers and thieves, it's contemptible. I mean, isn't that exactly what I've been doing? I've been robbing corpses. Helmadelka. We've talked enough, I think. Relics need cleaning. Texts need deciphering. Out with you! This isn't a museum. Helmadelka. Alright. Be that way, Lem. I'll come back for more Geo. Where do you have all that Geo from, anyway? I'm watching you. Okay, I'm really glad I just did that. Um, secret up here? No. Let me go... No, no let me not do that. Uh, this one. So I'm conflicted again now. Okay, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go down here. I'm gonna go down and to the right. Because there's also this area down below. I, I don't want to do that yet. Definitely, before that, I want to do Crystal Peak. Uh, nice, there's even a symbol on the map now for that guy. So that's what that symbol means. Again, another... Oh, look at this. Hornet! Again, we meet little ghost. I'm normally quite perceptive. You, I underestimated. Though I've since guessed the truth. You've seen beyond this kingdom's bounds. Yours is resilience born of two voids. It's no surprise, then, you've managed to reach the heart of this world. In so doing, you shall know the sacrifice that keeps it standing. The sacrifice that... Hold on. Born of two voids. One of the voids has to be the never-ending stretching void of the outside. What is the other void? I mean, she could be talking about, I guess, the shadow that I am? Because when I die uh, and the shell breaks, I'm just a shadow. That could be interpreted as a void, I guess. 
So maybe she... But then, yeah, she calls me Ghost, right? Maybe that's just a reference to my shadowy form that she knows that I am. So one of them, one of the voids is my shadow form and the other one is the never-ending uh, void of the outside. Of the desolate plains outside Hellonest. The heart of this world. Does she mean that Hellonest is actually the heart of the world? In so doing, you shall know the sacrifice that keeps it standing. What sacrifice? If, knowing that truth, you'd still attempt the role in Hellonest's perpetuation. Seek the grave in ash and the mark it would grant to one like you. Hold on. If, knowing that truth, you'd still attempt the role in Hellonest's perpetuation. Seek the grave in ash. Hold on. Grave in ash. So we're not going to fight? And the mark it would grant to one like you. Hmm. Do I want to... Do I want to roll in Hellness perpetuation? It doesn't seem very perpetual right now. It seems very dead. I mean, if, it, if I can restore the glory of the city and the kingdom, I would. And off she goes. Look at that. That looks eerily like me. With the horns? Eh, maybe not actually. Look at the three... Oh, here. Memorial to the Hollow Knight! In the black vault far above. Through its sacrifice, Hellenist lasts eternal. Black, black Egg Temple added to map. What the fuck? You know what? You see the three figures standing around him. Sorry, I didn't mean to click on it again. The three figures here. One of them is facing us so we can see the mask. That is the same mask that Quirrell is wearing. It's also one of the same masks on the Black Egg. All of this is connected. Through its sacrifice, Hellenist stay, stands eternal. Meaning the guy in the middle sacrificed something to keep the city standing? But it's not really standing, is it? It's dead. What are you talking about? Is everyone delusional here? The Graven Ash, what is that? I have so many questions. And so many notes to take after this shit. It's a beautiful area though, I have to say. Very nice fountain. Splendid execution. Well done. Okay, wait, wait, was there anything else I could do here? I didn't attempt if there was a wall jump over here. Oh, look at that. There's a special kind of bug there. Hmm. I see a switch on the other side. So I have to get there through some other way. So I, I guess... Hornet is a pro Hellenist person then. I mean, she's the protector of the ruins, right? So I can become a, pro a protector of the ruins too? Is that what I'm hearing here? So I do see a way there on the map. Let me show you. Right there. That will probably allow me to go over here. Maybe down here and then open the door from this side. 
Let me do that. So I go this way. And up. Uh, further up? Even further up? Oh shit. Nah, what am I doing? Damn it. I'm hearing one of those buggers on the roof. No, uh, the other way. There. Uh, there. Uh, wait, 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 did I explore all that? I think I did. How do I... Ah, it's up here. It's... I see it, I see it now. Ah, here we go. No! That's right. I was here. Let me mark that. Let me say, um, key needed, so that's this one. Or well, not key, but like it's blocked in a way, right? Man, I'm really fucking up with these symbols here. I'm gonna remember it though, don't worry. I say that, of course I will not. Um, I guess I go, let me go back to Crystal Peak, I guess. I feel like I'm blocked down here now. My progress is stunted. Um, wait, it is this way, I guess. No, fuck, how do I get up there? Is it just further up? Ah, okay. And then left. Nice. Buddy. Come down. Go. Right, this was the corner for area. We also healed just in case. This is where Soat was. Complaining about being wet. So I go up here now. Whoa, buddy. Ah! This is risky. Oh my god. Oh shit, what am I doing? This is a uh, this is bad. Bad form. Bad form. I'm leaving! <laughs> Man. Get up there. Let's take the stack station. Ah. Map updated. Let's see that map. Nice. Or maybe, actually, maybe I have to go through the sewer here and then emerge on the other side. That is actually quite a possibility here. I didn't consider that. But, let me go to Crystal Peak. I want to explore all that stuff now. Also, I love the music there, so I just want to go there. Um, I guess I go to Forgotten Crossroads. No, I don't want to do that. Please. Uh, up, up and right. Okay. Man, th these maps here are actually getting very complicated. Like, the more you... Wait, did I go too far? You fucker. Here. This is it. I'm Lantern Man now. I see everything. And the background is actually ominous. I don't know what those things are. They look like cocoons. On shelves. Ow! I'm being very inattentive right now. For some reason. Okay. Let's focus here. Crystal Peak. Don't have a map. Have I gone this way before? I think so. I think this is where I broke down through the floor upstairs and came down like this. Where Mila was. Okay. So what was down here? These buggers? Okay, so they're actually just immune to damage from behind. And I'm doing way more damage to them now after that nail upgrade. I'm actually so glad I went back. Yeah. 
I can still hit them with the spell from the back, though. That goes straight through them. Aha! I can jump on those. Let me do this systematically. Let me see what's down here first. Is there a secret here? Okay. What about down here? Ah! Okay, that's death. <laughs> Good to know. Uh, heal. I just want to see. Is the, like, imagine if there's a secret right below me here. You know, like, right where I'm hovering now. I'm just looking down. That's why I'm so weirdly here. Moving weird. God, I'm so confused. Oh my god! <laughs> Wait a... Did I def... Hold on. Ah! <laughs> I deflected that. That's fucking great. Love it. Love... Bench! Let's go grab the bench. This is actually where I started the episode. Now I'm back. I can go to the right. I can go up. I think I did this last time just a little bit. Let me go to the right. Wait a minute. I want to see if there's a secret here. Okay. Man, I love the music here. So what do you do? You shoot crystals that explode. Okay. Or expand. Got it. Noted. Uh, can I deflect the crystal? Shoot it. Come on. Hey! Oh yeah, we, we, we're getting updates in the journal. I have to read these. Crystal Hunter. Fu Fire shards of fast-growing crystal at intruders. Glimback. Slow, hardy creature. The crystals that grow on its back provide extra protection from foes above. Yeah. What else did I find? Did I find something new? Uh... Da -da 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 -da. I feel like I have neglected this journal a little bit lately. Sh shade. Yeah. It says defeat one more to decipher the hunter's notes. I think we're gonna have another fight. I feel like that's sort of a spoiler. The way they did that. Um, maybe she's leading me into a trap. Oh my god, look at that. <laughs> awesome. Ow! These are bastards, man. And this crystal... Do I take... I actually take damage from going into that. Heal. Oh, look at these. They don't have uh, orange glow in their eyes. But when they see me, then they have. Look. Fuck you. Fuck you. <laughs> I want to throw it back at them. <laughs> Amazing. Oh man, I'm just being reminded of Myla now and it makes me sad. Uh, hey, yo. There we go. Also, I think I get it now. There's a like, little <sighs> sound whenever I kill one of these. And I think that's just saying, hey, the journal is being updated or like you're progressing the journal. So that one's going to flip. Let me see here. What do we have? Breakable walls, maybe? Oh, my God. Okay. Shit. Conifer, I need you. I need you. Wait. This is where I came from. I am a silly goose. I did all that. Did I go this way, though? Man, I am completely lost. 
Oh shit. Fuck you. Oh man, they are actually kind of difficult. Not gonna lie there. Like, I just, I, I, I'm always getting hit by these. I need to find a better way of dealing with them. Wait, did I just hit it from the back? No, I don't think I did. Look at the way the music has transitioned slightly while I'm in here. Or maybe not. I'm not quite sure. Hey, what the hell is that over there? I see shaman things. Got another snail shaman or something. Whoa! Douche! <gasps> Look at all these statues. Seal of Hallow Nest. Common bug. Uh, the guy who died for hell for hell Nest since. <laughs> The statue down below, right? At least I'm looking at the horns there. Inspect. Cursed are those who turn against the king. Where am I? Cursed are those who turn against the king. Cursed in what way? Cursed as in... Sick? Cursed as in afflicted? Is that what happened? The king did something that the people didn't like and there was a revolt? And because they all turned against the king, they all succumbed? And because everyone succumbed, the kingdom went under? I'm assuming a lot of things in, in what I just said there. It's not actually what I believe, but... This area is interesting. Is it a graveyard? Where? It definitely is a graveyard. A stag station! Really? Toll booth. Mechanism with a slot for some kind of pass. Oh no, I don't have a pass. Oh, I know what it is. I know what it is. It's the thing that connects. See? Yep. It's the tram. I get it. I need to find a pass somewhere. I should be able to buy that online though or through an app, I guess. Maybe not in this world. Let me just sully your graves, if you don't mind. What a weird area. Okay. This is definitely... Part of the City of Tears. Look at the background there. The structures. The architecture. Very, very similar. But then not really. Like, look at the ground I'm walking on. They look like skulls of dead bugs. I feel like there's a boss coming here. Uh-oh. These are the three masks on the black egg. Speaking of the black egg, I have to go back there. Because now that it's been marked on the map, I think something is, has happened there. I don't know what. But maybe Quirrell is back there, you know? Oh, shit. Actually, these three are the three I saw after I defeated Hornet the first time. And they said something like, it would seek to break the seals. And then they said, hold on, let me just find my note here. Um, what did it say? Where did I put that? Hmm... Yeah. I'm here to break three seals, or they think I'm gonna do that. 
They say, okay, here it is. Would it seek to break the seals? They cannot be undone. They must be undone. Let us sleep, little shadow. Return to your darkness. Allow us our peace. Return to your darkness. Does that mean I came from darkness? I mean, assuming I can trust these. The reason I'm saying all this before I click on this right now, by the way, is because I want to be as ready as possible for whatever lore is coming my way, so I understand it. Um, okay. Also, this was related to the Mothwing cloak. This whole vision triggered after I used that. To protect the vessel, the dreamers lay sleeping. Monomon the teacher, in her archive, surrounded by fog and mist. Fog Canyon? Lurian the watcher, in his spire, looking over the city. City of Tears. Hera the beast, in her den amidst the deep darkness beyond the kingdom. Deep darkness beyond the kingdom, so is she outside of Hellonest in the void that stretches never-ending? Through their devotion, Hellonest lay lasts eternal. Sleeping, huh? The dreamers. Sorry, I'm just writing the names here. Lurian, the Watcher... Here are the beasts. Huh. Lurian the Watcher in his spire looking over the city. Is that why he's called the Watcher? Is he like a peeping Tom? Monomon the Teacher is a, is a female. And Hera is also a female. Okay. I wonder if it's in that order. With the masks on top there, so the left one with the two eyes and the two eyebrow-looking things. Okay, four eyes is Monomon. One eye is Lurian the Watcher, which makes sense, a Watcher. You know, like, uh... Well, I'm thinking of some guy standing up there looking through a telescope, you know? And a telescope has one eye. And then Hera the Beast, the one with six eyes. In her den. That has to be a spider or some shit. All right. Dreamer locations added to map. They're speaking to me right now. This is the same type of vision I had when I used the Mothwing cloak. Go no further, little shadow. What compels its climb out of the darkness? What compels its return to this sacred kingdom? Climb out of the darkness. A call from beyond the seals? By the vessel? Or by that captive light? Was I called by the vessel or some light? I don't understand. Would the seals break? They cannot be undone. But the vessel weakens. That plague springs anew. They must be undone. Wait, what? They m Hold on. Why, mu why must they be undone? So I can do them again? Are they saying... Okay, hold on. Yet still our seals remain. Our duty holds. It must be cast away. Our duty holds. It shall be done. Here they are. What? Fade away, little shadow. Fade away and let us sleep in peace. What the fuck?
Hold on a second. I recognize all these symbols. I don't remember where, but I've seen these. The glowing symbols in the background there. I've seen them somewhere in this game. Look at the lampposts. They're no longer ammonites. They're now these weird seals. They almost look like dream catchers. Which would make sense, I guess, if they're dreamers. Like, look at these hanging here. Dream catchers. Am I in a dream? Am I dreaming right now? Yo. Am I in a haze right now, just like Sly? Okay, okay, okay. I have to... When I wake up from this, I have to look out for the haze symbol. If there's any orange glow in my eyes. I'm dreaming. Who are you? Dude, dude! Look at the wing. This is totally Mothwing. Mothwing cloak. What a terrible fate they visit upon you. To cast you away into this space. Between body and soul. Will you accept their judgment and fade slowly away? Or will you take the weapon before you and cut your way out of this sad, forgotten dream? I don't know. Do I? Am I being given a choice here? Look at the statue behind me. That is totally a statue of the of the glowy guy that just disappeared. Taking the dream nail. Hold triangle to charge and slash with the nail. Cut through the veil between dreams and waking. Notice also how the background is white and all the text is black. It's usually the complete opposite. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. What the shit? Wait, that's the statue of this guy? He looks a little bit like Sly. Seer. Ah, you've returned. Welcome back to the waking world. So I was dreaming. Those figures, those dreamers, they reached out with what little power they still have and dragged you into that hidden place. But that talisman you now wield, the dream nail, it can cut through the veil that separates the waking world from our dreams. Even the dreamers themselves cannot hide from such a weapon. Though I must admit, that sacred blade has dulled over time. Together, perhaps, we can restore its power. You only have to bring me essence. Essence. The precious fragments of light. That dreams are made of. Collect it wherever you find it and bring it to me. Once we have enough, we can work wonders together. Who are you? Go out into the world, wielder. Hunt down the essence that lingers there. Wielder. Collect the hundred essence and return to me. I will teach you more. Okay. 
cool, I guess. Oh, I can't. I have to hold it. Huh. You're still unpracticed in the way of dreams. Collect the hundred essence with the dream nail. Visit me again and I will share what little wisdom I have. Essence can be found wherever dreams take root. Have you seen them? Those whispering plants that grow all over this old kingdom. <gasps> That's what they are, man! I've seen them multiple places. The purple ones. And they totally have dream catchers on them. That's what they are. That's the thing I remembered when I saw the things in the dream. I believe there is one just outside. Why not strike it with your dream nail and see what happens? Aha! Uh -huh. uh -huh. Interesting. Hmm. Yeah, okay. Alright. Hold your fucking horses here. Look at that! Almost looks like a, uh, a mirror. Allows the wielder to cut through the veil. Can be used to reveal hidden dreams or open gateways. The dream nail can collect essence, remnants of wishes and dreams. Okay. Uh, alrighty then. Where am I right now? Resting grounds. Oh my god. Did I fall asleep? At those three statues. And then this seer came by. Picked me up. And dragged me back here? Or maybe I was dreamwalking here. Oh my god, it's sensing me, look. Oh man, the music! Who made this music? It's fucking fantastic. Oh man. I'm loving this so much. This game slaps. I'm gonna press triangle in the next episode. Thanks for watching. Have a fantastic day. Bye.